And we're right back in it. Hello everyone, last time we got shot in the back by a government agent and it hurt. And now we're like... So we were running away, but like, what if instead of running away I kidnapped this government agent? And then... Sold him. For $80,000. Okay, they are now actually coming this way. It's definitely time to leave. You know there's more of them over there. It's not just one government agent. There's more dudes here. Just shoot him back, because he's a jerk, and then get out of there. Dang, that guy's suit is tough. Was hoping to steal more things before I ran away. Yeah, there we go. Well, he's not well. He's not that hurt either. Maybe I can knock him out. With bullets. Maybe I can miss him five times in a row. That's also a possibility. I don't think I can leave him there. Okay. Well, he's not going to keep shooting me now. We'll make this swap. I do want to loot more of that garbage from over there. Ma'am, run inside please before you pass out. Thank you. Now you can pass out. That's fine. Just checking I was recording. I am in fact recording. That is great news. Okay. Two more of them out here. One of them is the one we knocked out earlier who was walking up. One of them has a sniper rifle. Horrible things have just happened to that guy. Who saw that coming? Okay, you need to go away from this horrible place. You need to give them medical attention since you can't fucking do anything else because you're only regenerating four energy a turn. Ah. Uh... What's the best way to make a fighting retreat while still stealing enough things that this is almost worth it as an expedition? Well, that's not good. Definitely more of them outside the craft. some looting. Oh no, he fell down again. How horrible. You are not doing that well on stuff. Realizing something. Radical Predator, you're about to pass out. You shouldn't be here. We have at this stage killed quite a lot of them. Probably even more now. Oh. 
Hey, how you doing? Hoping not to see you here, to be honest. This is fine. Get out of the way. You can't do. You can do absolutely fuck all right now. Well, that's a shame. How many men could reasonably be on this ship? We do need to save your life, though. Um, do you have medical? Not really. Do you have medical? Yes. Drop this. Throw this. To you. Use this on your friend to save their life. Now we will need to pick them up and carry them away. Because they're not going to wake up because it's too cold. Um, we could really use the Hydra laser as well. This should, if I was a sensible person, be the thing that tells me, hey, you shouldn't be here. Time to leave. I think the purple warning is from Connor Lady, who's thinking about what she's done. No one has any stamina left. It's not coming back. Steal what's not nailed down. Get out of there. We have more rifles than we used to. This is a good situation. Um, except for all the people who had incidents recently. We gave it a real go. I'm proud of me. Good job, me. We're going to steal a little bit, Master. Still running around in there. That's fine. Not worried about that. Probably be worried about that. Dang! That guy's tough. Yay, yeah, you're not getting energy back now either. Do I have a grenade? This is a fresh boy. I know it can't be the last one because I can hear him opening doors inside. There's absolutely no way he was opening doors inside. There's also no way that's going to kill him. That guy had a rocket launcher. That's fine. Do you steal another grenade? I thought you stole two. I want the rocket launcher, though. Okay. We do need rocket launchers. They're important things to have. Useful bits of kit. We can stick around for a rocket launcher. That was the last bullet. You can see him, which means he can see you. Just get out of the way, I want my treasure. 
killed too many people to accept that I'm not allowed the treasure. Book hunt mode? There's only two of them left! This is how it happens. This is how you end up killing an entire... Ship full of people you weren't supposed to kill. He is bleeding. That hurt him as well. We don't need to shoot him anymore. Frankly. You go inside because you're about to pass out. You're also about to pass out. You do have a knife. You could give me the knife. I could use the rocket launcher to kill the last guy. Okay, don't miss. Do you have a melee weapon? You do not. You need one. That's fine. We can find a gun on one of these people that will kill the guy we want to fight. For example, this grenade. That guy's gonna... Well, that's a shame. Can't really help you. Um... Don't know what you're holding. Could easily check. Oh, gone. Don't have enough AP to throw this at you. But. That can happen, that's fine. We can do that. You should probably go back the other way now. That's a shame. That is very tragic. Now we throw this grenade at the last one. Who we can see on the map. Nope. Is he in the craft? Did he walk into my craft? Why do you walk into my craft? Minus 151, that's fine. We only got one hostage. It's the guy who tried to steal my craft. Um, we got lots of injuries and a death. We got some treasure. Expensive treasure. We got 50 millimeter cannon parts, tactical vest, heavy suit, human defender armors, two of. We got some good loot from that. I'm gonna stand by that being worth it. Got some a bunch of garbage, I don't even know what it does. And sell their engine. We got a lot of stuff. We got 10 landmines, 20 frag grenades, and a rocket propelled grenade launcher. What more could we want? <laughs> Not to have lost a bunch of points, I guess, but you know, we attack the government. They don't like it when we do that. They're the ones who were paying us, and we did shoot a lot of them. I understand. And we'd, we'd, we'd lost the hydro laser clip. clip, that's fine. Who shot one of their friends? Please don't do that. Master of the heavy shotgun. Yeah, th this is... You get that for passing out a lot in missions. That's fine. Shame about the death. Pure stockings. The Sleeping Beauty bullet magnet. Hmm. 
The wound times are bad, but if we ignore them completely and never look at or think about them, and how bad the roster looks right now, everything's fine and good. Everything's fine. This is normal. This is a normal roster. No, we don't have anyone coming. Why would we have anyone coming? Hmm. I feel like we need to buy more people. <laughs> For some reason. To be fair, these are going to be back pretty soon. And we do have enough for most of a squad. Let's not go crazy. Also, can I build a living quarters over one of these burrows? I can! I wish it had asked me to confirm that because I'm not sure I would have done, but hey, now we can definitely buy two more people. <laughs> oh, no, we can. That's weird. The burrow doesn't exist anymore. We have more than maximum population. What well, about an old rifle? It's a Garand. Cumbersome but dangerous weapon in the hands of a skilled user. Twenty. Mm, uh, I mean, it, it goes up a little bit. Like, a really good unit could could boost that by, like, 12 or 13, and then it does 36 damage, which is less bad. We've got a lot of these military policemen. We keep finding them. No idea where. <laughs> also, out of that garbage, what can we research? And by garbage, I mean very important loot that was extremely worth getting. What is human defender armor? We got armors. Now, problem with the... Ooh, we can buy those. Problem with the armors. You can make people wear them. And you can even see what happens to the stats. Okay, whoever's got the most strength gets the heavy suit. But you can't see how much armor it is. <laughs> Ah, oh, dang. Nice. And you two can have tactical vests. I do like the tactical vests. Don't offer a lot of armor, but gives you a nice little bit of front armor and an all-round resistance to bullets. A tiny one. I believe. Not that I've researched them, so I can check. That's fine. Um... We'll even use the air car so we get there faster. By which I mean air van. Can the peasants have the human armors? <laughs> yes! If I give them the defender armors, will they be able to move? One way to find it. Actually, there's two ways to find out. <gasps> She's Master Chief. Oh, dang! The Dumpy in blue! <laughs> Get in there, Karina Hopkirk. Gabrielle Van Valkenburg. Whoever we're up against is not going to know what hit him. Oh, it's a Red Lantern Villa. Hmm. All right, no, we can't fit that on. See, we have a full squad if we use the smaller craft that can fit less people on it. You never know when you're going to need a landmine or a rocket propelled grenade launcher or a fire machine gun. You know? 
These are all valid concerns. The sniper rifle I'm not sure anyone's good enough to use yet. They're really crap if you don't have the stats for them. Did someone just yell, Come on! Can we... <laughs> Can we get a replay on that? Did I imagine that? Come on! That were a roller coaster, that last mission. <laughs> it's gonna be night, which is absolutely fine for these. Because. Dang, I wanna see how much ammo the Master Chief. We can in game see how much defense it has. We just can't see here. Can hold a rifle. Your firing skill is so low, you probably shouldn't. Okay, what can you actually hold? The ammo might be a little bit heavy for him. You know what? I can give her a medical back. What am I even talking about? This is perfect. What a good loadout. We can even hold a grenade. Don't put the bullets in the leg slots. I think it takes longer to get them out. Uh, the hydro laser doesn't have bullets. What if Master Chief had a baseball bat? What would you do? Master Chief is coming at you with a baseball bat. Watch your move. Write in the comments. <laughs> Actually, don't write in the comments. You don't have time. Master Chief is coming. He's gonna crack you over the head with that baseball bat. You don't want that. That's not gonna be good. It's not gonna be a good situation. Most of these uh, ladies who didn't get wounded already are pretty bad. Does anyone have good firing? You have okay firing. I want you to hold this thing. Tell me if it's good. And tell me if you can bop someone with it, because that's also important. Um, Considering you do kind of want to use stun on a lot of the enemies in these missions. What's the least terrible pistol that I currently have? It's definitely not the six shooter. But I don't want to waste the Desert Eagle on people who'll die in one shot from the six shooter. I don't want to use the. I don't know. Okay, how much armor? <gasps> That's good armor. That is bulletproof armor. How much armor? Not bad. Don't get shot in the back, but it's not bad. Master Chief has a baseball bat, and he's coming to get you. There's nothing you can do. I just thought you should be informed. Hey, shoot back. See what happens. Shoot Karina Hopkirk. Do it now. Never mind. Maybe next turn. We can convince someone to shoot at Karina Hopka. Now the trick is, we don't want to get too cocky. Now we have this bulletproof arm. Because, it's, maybe there's bigger bullets than we know about that are out there that could get me. That wouldn't be great. Why are we not holding this? Um, And there's things that aren't bullets that can absolutely get me. But, I don't think I should have this armor right now. I don't think this is a normal thing to have right now. <laughs> and that makes me very happy. Okay, I believe in you. Gabrielle. Why are you shooting, Gabrielle? She only did it. She only gone and did it. Don't shoot that last achievement. Who shoots Master Chief? Was that your answer when I asked what you'd do? Wrong answer. Don't shoot Master Chief. He has a rechargeable shield, don't you know? 
it's just not going to do anything. I'm in danger of having too much fun and getting cocky here. <laughs> hmm. We got more holes in the building. Taking the shot. <laughs> I don't know why I bother making him fire. Do they get better or are they stuck like this? Has, epi has a peasant ever survived long enough for anyone to learn if they get better or not? Um, I'm a bit worried about that building and you're one of the ones who doesn't have good armor. Who is this? Ooh, he's got a hat. Yep, it's not going to do a lot. <laughs> he can shoot me all day. See what happens. Okay. Was your answer just stand around when I asked you what you'd do if Master Chief with a baseball bat was coming at you? Because that is also wrong. That's not going to do anything for you either. Come on, take her out. Can we recruit this hoe and give her the armor? She's better at this than I am. It's fine, we've got another magazine we can put into the wall next to her. If that doesn't do it, I don't know what will. I want you to come around. I don't think they'll be able to shoot you if you're right there in the corner. I really don't want you to get shot in the back and killed. That would make me very upset. If I just got all this nice armor and they go and squander it. By letting you get shot in the back. Why did I give you two frag grenades? I'm never going to use a frag grenade on these. Those, those frag grenades aren't cheap. We're learning a lot of ways to not defeat Master Chief, who's coming at you with a baseball bat. We're also learning a lot of ways, a lot of ways to not stun enemies who you're trying to stun. That's fine. They. Sometimes people do show up with Molotovs on these missions. Ideally, we wouldn't get lit on fire, even in the nice new armors. It's probably not ideal. Tends to not be healthy. As a pastime. Um, get in there. Behind Blue Master Chief, please. Who's actually a peasant. And is very scared, and people keep firing guns at her. Yeah, I know. I know he's there. Dang. <laughs> Keeps happening. Okay, it's probably through there is the uh, highwayman. The bad lad. You don't want to see. Oh, never mind. We found the highway man. She's fine. The power. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> She's fine. Never been better. There goes the highwayman. Now to go kill some more people we're trying to stun. Maybe I should throw Master Chief the, uh, the stun rod. Maybe that'd help. <laughs> Definitely upset.
Oh, and that was just 30 minutes rolling over. That's going to be the end of this episode. Next time, we're going to continue to look at Master Chief and giggle. <laughs> I hope to see you then. Thanks for being here, folks.